On today's show, we're stopping by one of my favorite places to grab something healthy on the go and also pick out that extra special something for our loved ones for those life's moments. We're going to be joining Karen Rayborn. She's over business development with Edible Arrangements. So get those taste buds ready for this delicious episode of Authentic Living. My good friend Karen Rayborn at Edible Arrangements in Apopka. Listen, this is one of my family's favorite spots to drop in on after a quick workout. Our gym's actually in the same plaza, which is really cool. And we like to stop by and get a fresh fruit smoothie. So Karen, thanks so much for having us oh, today. Thank you so much for coming. I can't wait to have you see all the great things that we do here at Edible Arrangements. Well, you know, one of the things that I've learned over this past year since you and I have met each other is that Edible Arrangements has storefronts now where you can actually come in and get something sweet and also something healthy on the go. So why don't you tell us a little bit about some of the things you provide because everybody knows your beautiful Edible Arrangements and that cool little jingle and all the commercials that we see nationally. And, and obviously we think Edible Arrangements, we think of all the special holidays and occasions and to get somebody we love or a friend, you know, a special arrangement. But you guys have some really cool things on your menu. So why don't you tell us a little bit today about what you guys offer now? Yeah, I'm so excited because we have locations all over the country and um, people order online or they call and don't realize that we actually have a store. Right. So all of our locations have a store, and so we have our edible to-go treats, our sweet treats. So we do fresh fruit smoothies, we have fruit salads, we have calm cups, we provide um, uh, special uh, pops for in the arrangement. So just a variety of things that you can grab and go. Say you've got something that you need to go to, and you're like, oh my gosh, I need to take something. What am I going to take? You can run in here, and we have arrangements that are made fresh daily that we have in the case that you just grab and go. So we are all about making it convenient and exciting and yummy for everybody so, to enjoy. It's convenient, it's, it's exciting, and you guys make us look good too, Yeah, right? we do, so, we do. Um, and especially when it comes to parties or events or things like that too, you know, it's always that thing, what do I bring? Or, you know, or a housewarming gift or something like that. And I love the edible arrangements to go because you guys also have cards here that, you know, you can write a quick thank you card or congratulations on your baby. You guys ha have actually like card style, regular card right. style cards that have something special in it. Um, but one of the things that I love the most is that you guys have a smoothie bar, which is kind of cool. So you have all of this fresh fruit on location. And I know a lot of times people, when they're busy like me, a mom on the go, or you're running from your workout and you want to stop in and get something healthy, it's kind of hard to find that place. But we want people to know now that Edible Arrangements is that place to get something healthy on the go. So let's talk a little bit too about your presence as a business in the community because a lot of people don't know that you guys are a store location now. So what are some of the things you do as a business development um, expert for edible arrangements uh, to get out in the community and make your presence known? Right. So I do the business development for six locations here locally in Orlando, and I engage in corporate and business gifting. Um, I belong to chambers, three different chambers. I'm ambassador, different networking groups. So I connect with businesses. Um, what better, what better thing to do than to thank your clients? You know, say you land a big client or you're trying to woo someone to do business with you right. and you make an appointment with them and you have that conversation, they haven't made a decision and you're like, hmm, you know what, I really want to land this account. So you give us a call and you order a thank you gift and have it delivered to them. Okay, that just puts you one step above the next person. Hmm. And it's a great way to just, just to thank people, you know, um, the old-fashioned day is a writing hand thank you notes and you know, you know people are doing emails to thank people but but to really make an impact on someone um, that's where we come in so we have you know just any kind of arrangement that you want to send if you want to do boxes um, say you have a business that is going to make a presentation at another office we're doing catering now so we have catering awesome. platters 
So the platters will serve 12 people. They come with everything that needs to be, you know, with the napkins and the, and the plates and the tongs. So literally you can order that and pick that up within, you know, an hour, you know, give us at least a little bit of time. Because we, we make everything fresh the same day for, you know, for delivery and for pickup. And that's a good thing to know that everything is that same day fresh made. And when you bite into that pineapple or that strawberry, it's not, you know, it doesn't taste 10 days old. Everything is that's super right. fresh. You know, one of the things I love partnering with you with our show through Authentic Living is just the power of thank you. And like you said, I think that's something that's missing in, in our, our society today is Absolutely. letting people know that they're special. You appreciate them. Everything's not just expected. It's not just a quick exchange, but it's really about building that lifelong relationship and just learning some of the history of edible arrangements. It's really about the heritage and the legacy of making life's moments sweeter because you and I both know life is tough, right? Yes. We've got, you know, all kinds of obligations, expectations expectations and then there's devastating things that happen in life too and you guys even serve um, the local community and people in times of bereavement as well so tell us about some of the things you guys provide um, just to you know let people know that they're special and they're appreciated and you're thinking of them during a time of a loss as well right so we have a whole bereavement correction collection thinking of you mm -hmm. um, and the focal point of that arrangement um, the pineapples are our signature fruit for our shapes mm -hmm. So we have a pineapple shaped dove that we dip in white chocolate and it's just so peaceful and serene looking and so that's like the focal point in those arrangements um, and you know unfortunately we probably get four or five of those a week wow. at our different locations because you know life is short and people are passing away and the days really of, of sending flowers um, you know, you spend so much money on the flowers and they die, but especially with going for someone's funeral reception, you know, the family gathering, just to have another thing to eat there or to send it ahead of time. The family is not thinking about eating, but they That's need so some true. hydration. They need something to give them energy. And what better than fresh fruit and chocolate? <laughs> yeah, it is. It's a good combination. And, and that's why we love edible arrangements is because you want to make life's moments sweet, no matter what we're going through or growing through in life. And even if it's we're running in on the go um, or it's a special occasion, you guys really customize those special things in life. And one thing I love too, you guys are innovative and, and cutting edge. So you're always coming out with something new. One of the cool things that you did last year, I remember, was for uh, International Donut Day, right? Yeah. You guys actually made us healthy donuts. Well, semi-healthy, right? Right. So no, they, they were apple. healthy. <laughs> right. There were apple rings and, and the chocolate, and they actually looked like donuts. And I thought people loved that. That was a healthy spin on a fun tradition that people look forward to annually. As well, it well. was so funny because <laughs> we did launch our donuts, you know, for Donut Day, and we still have those available, and we have all different, you know, shapes and uh, decorations for sports mm -hmm. themes. You know, we had pumpkins, we had jack lanterns we had the Christmas wreaths right. so but it was funny because people would come in and they're like okay where's the donuts you know they were thinking an actual <laughs> exactly. donut yeah so it's a granny smith apple that's poured out and shaped like a donut and then we just go to town and decorate it so that's awesome yeah. well and I love the creativity and you guys are really open to customizing whatever it is you know that your customer wants and needs so right. what I'm looking forward to customizing now is our fresh fruit smoothie because this is something I love I enjoy it, something I can grab on the go. And it's something our kids can enjoy as well. I know we're just in this society right now, fast food and convenience and going through the drive through but we want people to look at edible arrangements and the edible to go in a new, fresh way That's where right. they can get something healthy on the go. So we're gonna have Jessica helping us, right? She's one yeah, of our experts. Yeah. Um, so we'll be joining her in a moment and she's gonna help us customize our fresh fruit smoothie. All right. All right, looking forward to it. Well, I'm back with my favorite fresh fruit expert, Miss Jessica. It's so great to be with you today. Nice to see you. And nice to see you again. So one of my favorite smoothies that I love to drop in on the go, and my kids love this one too, I think it's the pineapple banana strawberry smoothie. Good choice. I know that's a mouthful, right? Yeah. But it's got a lot of great energy to it. Um, it tastes amazing. So why don't you take us through the steps today, how we can create our customized shake. Okay. All right, so we're going for the blender first, okay. obviously. Yeah. So one of the things that I love about edible arrangements and edible on the go is all the fruit that's in your case is fresh every single day. So everything is guaranteed fresh, everything is delicious, and it makes a big difference than having a frozen smoothie with frozen fruit. So what are some of the favorites that uh, your clients like to come in and get? One of the popular ones um, that's really healthy is the pineapple, kale, and um, honeydew. Oh, that sounds good. That refreshing, right? Very, yeah, very refreshing. Um, of course, we do a lot of the pineapple, strawberry mm -hmm. uh, smoothies. So one of my favorite fruits, obviously, is pineapple, and it's 
has a lot of uh, nourishment in it, the vitamin C. Um, but one of the cool things about your shakes is you have add-ins. So after we pick our fresh fruit, then we can maybe like after a workout, I come in and I'm gonna get some added protein in and just to fuel up a little bit so we can add in some protein as well. Right. So we're hydrating the fruit right now, right? right? That makes it blend a little bit better. Mm -hmm. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here. We're gonna add some ice to it. Obviously, being a Florida girl, this is something refreshing. Usually, it's hot the majority of the time out of the year, so this is something that's nice and cool and refreshing to get as well. And then we also use our pure cane syrup mm -hmm. as a sweetener. You gotta add a little sweetness to your life. It is edible arrangements after all, right? That's right. Okay, so what are we gonna do next? Blend it up? Yep, blend it up. Let it rip. One of the things too that you can add on to your fresh fruit smoothies during the summer months is you guys have froyo as we well. Do. Yes. So, so a lot of people don't know that about edible arrangements, but you can come in and get a, an ice cream treat as well. Yes. Yeah. So if you want more of like a milkshake type mm -hmm. fruit smoothie, you can do that. Very good. Okay, so this is all that goes into the shake. This is all okay. that goes in there. This is the base of the shake. And then, like we said, if you wanted to add anything in, like um, protein or you have granola, don't you guys even have like chia seed or some other add-ins we as well? Black seeds, yeah. Okay. Which helps keep things moving and grooving, right? Yes. Flowing and going. Okay, that looks amazing. And that's just fresh fruit, basically blended up with a little bit of syrup. Yep. Very good. And add some cool whip to it. Okay, so this is the added treat, right? So this is like the after school treat when you the have whipped cream. After school treat. Because my kids would love off. this. That looks amazing. And then we're gonna put a little strawberry to garnish this. Of course, you guys gotta put the finishing touch on it, right? That looks amazing. All right, cheers to edibles on the go. Mm. Literally taste the freshness of the fruit. And I think that's what set you guys apart from other smoothie shops as well. When we come back, we are actually gonna go back in the kitchen where you get one of these cool hair nets like Miss <laughs> Jessica has on. And we're gonna be joining Karen Rayborn again to make some of their signature arrangements. We'll be right back. Hey guys, Courtney Shaw here, back with Miss Jessica, our fruit expert here at Edible Arrangements. Yes, I am rocking a hairnet. This is happening. I'm like partially rocking it. So Jessica, this is where all the magic happens, right? This is what we know and love Edible Arrangements for, is their customized arrangements for all different occasions. So today, what are we gonna be making? We are going to be making one of our Valentine's arrangements that mm -hmm. we're gonna be specializing for Valentine's Day. And we are going to start with dipping some strawberries. Very cool. Well, everybody loves chocolate dipped strawberries. So why don't you show us to go ahead and get started with that? Okay, so hot chocolate, right? Hot chocolate, yes. Okay. And so now what type of chocolate do you guys use too? Because I know when people try to dip, you know, strawberries at home, sometimes they turn into that Pinterest fail as we call it, right? This is a semi-sweet chocolate. Okay. So let's go ahead and dip some strawberries. All right. So we're going to dip it in. Shake off our excess there. So we dip, shake, and, and then we're swirl. Gonna swirl it so that we ah, okay. Swirl. So it's all about that signature swirl all with the edible arrangements. Okay, very cool. So what is one of the, the things that you love being a part of edible arrangements? It is just an all around fun job. You get to be creative. Um, you get to be a part of making a person's day by giving them something that they didn't expect a lot of times. So, um, you know, our delivery drivers will get to see a lot of that because they actually deliver it and get to see the reactions, but you know that you're behind the scenes on that, making yeah. somebody's day. Um, so you get to make life's uh, moments a lot sweeter for your customers. We do. That's awesome. So what type of arrangements, I know you guys have arrangements for all different occasions, not just Valentine's Day, but all the major holidays as well, right? Yes. Very cool. Yeah, we do birthdays, Christmas, Halloween, New Year's. A little bit of everything, bit right? Of everything. Very cool. Okay, so we'll do a couple more, and then we're going to move on to actually building the base of the arrangement, too. Yes. Cool. Okay, so Jessica, we did our dip, we did our shake, and we did our swirl, and now it's all about that base. So show us how to build the base structure of an edible arrangement. Okay. Now, when somebody gets an edible arrangement, do they? How long can they keep it for? We say about two days. Okay. 
And one of the things too, when you talk about customization with your arrangements, you guys have all kinds of vases as well. We do. So we can go on edible.com and, and pick out any type of vase for whatever special occasion and you guys can customize it from there. Yes. And you know this is probably everybody's favorite part of an edible arrangement, right? It's that chocolate. Chocolate. Anything, right? Anything, yes. Okay. So we pop those in and fill it in. Now you can kind of start to see the arrangements really starting to come together. And so you have arrangements of all sizes too. This is probably like a small to medium size arrangement. Yeah, this okay. would be a, like a medium size. Now if somebody wanted to order a special arrangement, um, do they call in? Like how much time do they need to get their arrangement delivered? We can do it same day as long as it's, um, you know, early enough that we can get it made and get it out to be delivered still. That's really cool. So people can know that and if they don't, they can always jump in the front of the store, right? And get something That's out of the, right. the case as well. I love that. So we've got all different uh, heights and levels going on, different textures, different colors. And so this arrangement um, would go for what? Do you know um, price this wise? This one I would say would probably be around the 60 to $70 range. Okay, very cool. Well, thank you, Jessica. It's You're been welcome. so much fun. Our smoothie was amazing. The arrangement turned out gorgeous, and we're gonna close out with Karen. She's gonna give us a couple more tips and tricks of edible arrangements, so thanks so much. You're welcome. Well, Karen, what do you think? You're a quality control. How did it turn out today? Oh, it's beautiful. As Jessica always does a great job, and it's absolutely beautiful, and you have a Valentine. I do have a Valentine. I have a lot of Valentines in my life. Well, Obviously my hubby's one and my kids are my Valentine's too, but they love edible arrangements Well, you know well. what? I'm probably going to have to send this home with you and you're going to have to pick and choose who your Valentine is going to be okay. early. Well, so, sharing is caring, so I'll share right. it with the whole family. So I'm, I appreciate you rocking the hair now yeah, with me too. Well, I rocked it full on. I know that uh, <laughs> you know you have longer hair. This is that's partial. Okay. That's partial okay. commitment. That's okay. You weren't actually making, you were just observing, so it's That's okay. right. That's right. Okay. So I'm safe. Yeah. So let's, let's do some final thoughts here on edible arrangements. I know one of the things that sets you apart too is your passion for community because you know business is tough right now and a lot of people expect people to come to them into their location and now we know there's so many great things that we can come and treat ourselves with right. but what is your commitment to make an impact in the community and to give back as well well you know we have um, edible arrangements in general has a, a, a great legacy and they actually have a foundation as well but on a local level um, our owner Jihad Hanoush has six locations here in Central Florida Wow um, this one here in the pop is our newer location of two years and we have lots of nonprofits in the area that will send us requests you know can you sponsor this can you help with that we make donations of gift certificates to every nonprofit organization that is having a fundraising event it's incredible um, I attend some of those events mm -hmm. um, because it may be something that I'm connected with that I'm passionate about so we give out into the community um, in addition to that uh, different networking groups um, we do table displays you know I'm, we're always about um, giving giving away um, what we're passionate about. So, so you know, if, if there's something, you know, if say a, a fellow business person that I'm in the chamber with um, has a, a family loss, which hmm. just happened recently. That's true, yeah. Um, very good friend right over here in, mm -hmm. in the plaza here um, from Marcos. Um, we sent them, the Popka store sent them an, an, a bereavement arrangement, which we talked about earlier. So it's, it's about giving back and it just, it just makes us part of that community, which is so important um, to be out there. You know, it's basically, you know, just, we, we just want you to be out there. We just want the people to know that we make a presence in the community, that we make a difference. We did cuts for kids. We do the different taste of the different cities. And whenever we do an event like that, we're giving away samples, you know, whatever we can do to, to let people know, you know, some people have never had an edible arrangement. You know, we you have, haven't lived until you've had right, an edible arrangement. That's right. That's right. And I've even had, <clears throat> we even have uh, someone that says, you know, I've never gotten an edible arrangement, and they will actually order one and have it sent to themselves just to say <laughs> that they got it. You know, especially around Valentine's Day. That's so, right. You know, it's it's kind of funny, but but you know, people, you know, if you haven't had one, you've either sent one. Everybody knows the name. If you have ever had one, you've sent one. You know, you're you're gonna enjoy. It. So. Absolutely. Well, not only do we enjoy edible arrangements, but we enjoy you. We call you Miss Edible Arrangements because <laughs> so. you're really the heart behind oh. the brand here in the Central Florida community. And Thank we're so you. grateful for all that you do to give back and to spread joy and to nourish us with amazing treats. And thank you for today and, and teaching oh. us about what we can come and get on the go. We can get smoothies. We can pick up a quick gift. And we can also go to edible.com, right? That's right. where so we get all the information. Com. Um, we can also reach out to us on Facebook by our individual Facebook pages. So this store is 
is Edible Arrangements of Popka, store 1672, and um, all of our locations. So um, follow us on Facebook, give us a like, give us a review, yes. and enjoy a fresh, sweet treat. Well, thank you, Karen, for making life so much sweeter. Oh, thank you. Well, on today's episode of Authentic Living, we brought you on an exclusive behind the scenes tour of a beloved franchise called Edible Arrangements. Listen, you can stop in and get something healthy on the go for your family. You can pick up something to celebrate life's sweet moments. So I don't know what you're going through or going through life, through life right now. There's all kinds of ups and downs and in-betweens, but I just wanna encourage you to be intentional about celebrating every season of life. Tomorrow's not promised, so make sure that you're nourishing your body with good food, uh, like we had today on the Authentic Eats episode, but check out Edible Arrangements and make sure you get that special arrangement for the person you love.